Jessica Alba jumps once more into it mode with trigger advance notice. Jessica Alba hadn't even turned 20 when she turned into an activity star in the 2000 Fox series Dim Holy Messenger, which gives a setting to her revisitation of butt-kicking mode in Trigger Advance Notice, the sort of Netflix film that perpetually arrives on, or possibly close, its generally saw level. Without any trace of shocks, it's a productively vicious return for Alba after an extensive acting break, momentarily hindered by the cop show, Elda A's. Best. Coming a couple of months after she moved away from her other livelihood as organizer behind the legitimate organization, Trigger Admonition basically plays like a minor departure from the Dwayne Johnson redo of Strolling Tall, or, in other words, there's the same old thing here and sparse tension about the forms of the plot. In any case, Alba comes furnished with a steely demeanor and solid retribution inspiration as Parker, a unique powers commando who, following a short presentation in the field, gets brought back to her old neighborhood after her dad's passing, which rapidly gives off an impression of being more serious than the unintentional mine cavern I and I and expansion to the mine. Father ran the nearby watering opening. However, Parker cares barely at all about assuming control over her legacy. The more she stays nearby, however, the more dubious she becomes, which is muddled by her set of experiences with the neighborhood sheriff, Imprint Weber, the reality his sibling, Jake Fatigued, seems to be looking for trouble and that their dad, Anthony Michael Lobby, is a moderate congressperson who poses inconsiderate inquiries like what Ladinx signifies. Parker likewise gets some assistance from one of her father's representatives, Mike, the night specialist's Gabriel Basso. Yet in the long run, she must Schwarzenegger her way through this truckload of having proactively shown a talent for tight situation battle and employing a blade. Making her U.S. debut, Indonesian chief Mali Surya brings a dynamic, if somewhat dull, quality to the activity for those weaned on the John Wick style of battle movement, where wounding or shooting somebody once never fully is by all accounts sufficient. Alba believably handles that perspective, while depicting Parker as a lamenting girl, complete with gauzy flashbacks, to give her a smidgen more profundity than the standard killing automaton, Netflix has tracked down a prolific specialty by highlighting promotable stars in such classification passage where surveys, to be perfectly honest, don't make any difference much, with Jennifer Lopez's science fiction experience. Chart book among the new models. Trigger admonition probably won't pack anything unforeseen in the chamber, yet for the people who come to it with the legitimate outlook, the film doesn't end up shooting empty shells by the same token.